A San Fernando Valley man on life support says the DWP was threatening to cut off his power. Yes, he and his wife got behind on their bills because he's out of work due to his health. So they contacted two on your side for help, and CBS 2's Christine Lazar joins us now with their story. Rick and Pat, consumer advocates say that this is a big problem. Utility watchdog Turn says utilities will turn off power to people on life support, even those on hospice. <laughs> Even a trip to the kitchen for a glass of water leaves 53-year-old Bruce Ham struggling to breathe. <sighs> the Winnetka man is waiting for a double lung transplant due to COPD, a chronic lung disease. He's on oxygen around the clock. How much do you rely on oxygen? I gotta have it. I have to have it. If I don't have it, I um. I die. Hams and his wife are way behind on their DWP bill. He's on disability but only gets $130 a month. She's a school teacher. Their bill has ballooned to more than $5,600. Since not been out of work, um, it just got bigger and bigger and just got away from us. Last week, Ham says he was told by a DWP customer service rep that he had until this Friday to pay 20% of the bill, around $1,100. I told him that I'm on oxygen, you know, and they didn't seem to, to care or to worry, you know, they just said, well, it's, you know, you have to pay it. What did they tell you they would do if you didn't pay it? They'd cut the bill off if we didn't buy it. Desperate to keep his power on, Ham's contacted two on your side. He told us he's paid two to three hundred dollars every month in a good faith effort to the DWP. Ham showed us his bill where it lists his life support discount of about thirty-five dollars. So anybody pulling up your bill knows that you're on life support. Yes, they do. The California Public Utility Commission, or CPUC, prohibits a utility from shutting off power to anyone on life support without a home visit. But the DWP is not regulated by the CPUC because it's a municipal utility. Two on your side reached out to the DWP on Ham's behalf, and they visited his home that day. They assured us they will not cut off his power, and they've now given him four years to repay what he owes. The DWP says Hams has broken payment agreements five times, but they say he does qualify for income assistance, so that should get his bill going down moving forward. They're also going to send someone out to his house to make sure his usage is correct and that his home is energy efficient. There is a bill working its way through Sacramento right now that would prohibit utilities from cutting off power to anybody on life support, but the DWP would not have to follow that because they are not regulated by the CPUC. Mm. All right. Thank you, Christine. And we ask if uh, Two on Your Side can help you. All you have to do is email us at Two on Your Side at CBS.com with your problem or on Twitter. You can use the hashtag Two on Your Side, and we will see what we can do to help you solve your problem.